Welcome back to my channel, The Struggle is Real with the Makeup Nurse. Today I am going to go through some of my collection. I know I keep, I was supposed to do this like all at once before, but um, it's been a little bit difficult. So I got through most of my collection. Today we are going to do the powders and setting sprays. So let's get started. So I have this Tarte Shape Tape setting powder. I love it. And then I have the Cody Airspun. Um, I use this for my scented Saturdays sometimes. And then as far as um, Makeup Revolution for scented Saturdays, I have, for some reason, I ended up getting two of the peaches. I don't know. I probably wasn't paying attention. The banana one. Oh, that's. And the coconut one from Makeup Revolution. And they all smell like that. Then I have the It um, Cosmetics Bye Bye Pores um, Pressed Powder. Um, this was a sample, so. Uh, then I have from Physician Formula, I have a couple of their, um, I have this Rose um, All Day for, uh, Set and Glow. I have this pressed powder from the, them. Oh, this is, it's a light bronzer. I thought it was a setting powder. Hmm, that's what I've been using it as. I better put that in my bronzer collection. And then I have the Butter Butter um, Physician Formula one. And then I have the Flower Beauty Chance. I believe this is the Miracle Glow Satin Finishing Powder from Flower Beauty. And then I have um, Seattle London, the Extraordinary translucent powder um I, and i got a miniature one from in my ipsy glam bag i usually get samples and this was the sample and then in a different bag i got the full-sized one i do have a becca um one and this is the uh, hydro mist set and refresh powder i won that in a giveaway and then i have this banana powder from um I don't even know what it's, it just says banana setting powder. Oh, it says Belle Pierre. Oh, I didn't even know I had something from Belle Pierre in this. Hmm, interesting. And then from pharmacy makeup, I have this setting powder. Um, and I, um, it's a pressed. I sell, I sell pharmacy, so I, got a bunch of things uh like almost a full set of makeup from pharmacy so this is the setting powder i do like everything that they have so that's um good and then um well at least that i tried and then the, i have nk makeup perfection this is the finishing powder and then i have the from ruby kisses i have their setting put um, banana powder i have the by terry Hyaluronic Hydro Powder. I have this setting powder from VSP01 setting powder. Oh, Busy Art. When I'm filming this on a weekend, and you know what? When it gets to the weekend, I am. My brain's fried. And then I have this Pacifica. I have this um, matte powder, setting powder, neutralizing mineral mattifier, soft focus, translucent powder. Oh, it says it's translucent, but I've been using it as a actual powder. And then I have this um, translucent powder um, from Pacifica. And I use those as for scented Saturdays as well. Um, I've only tried this OPP. OPV Beauty London um, powder. This is a translucent um, in one of my try on videos after I got it. And then I have this Anastasia Beverly Hills um, translucent powder. Um, I used this a couple times. Bare Minerals, um, the original Mineral Veil, uh, tra original translucent powder, um, which my friend loves Bare Minerals. So if she ever gets her tail back here, She'll probably get it. 
Okay. Oh, and uh, another one from Physician Formula, the butterscotch one. I got um, a bunch of the butter butter ones because um, it smells so good. And for scented Saturdays. And then I have the Pure um, set, uh, Pressed um, Powder. And then I have the NYX Professional Makeup Illuminating Powder as well. And then I have from the Cream Shop, Cream Shop, Cream Shop, I put it translucent powder and it smells sweet. So I got this for a Sunday Saturday as well. I have to, you know me, I have to have my sun and makeup. Okay, so I have the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. And for um, Makeup Revolution, let's try to get all the Makeup Revolution ones. I think, oh, so I have their Super Fix Super Hold Misting Spray. I use it almost daily um, just because it's right there. And then I have their Pineapple Brightening Makeup Fixing Spray for Pineapple. I have their Mattifying Priming Spray um, for the Tasty Peach. And then I have their Watermelon Dewy Makeup Fixing Spray. And I use those for Sun Saturday. Um, the tart I use for two, two Tart Tuesday because it's the only one I have. It's supposed to have a little bit of a scent too, but I haven't been able to smell it lately. So I can't remember if it does or not. Um, then I have from Milani. I thought this one would smell um, like rose water. I, I'm not sure if it does, but um, the last time I used it, obviously I lost my scent, so I couldn't remember. I have the, so then I had to get the fruit fetish line, which is the dragon fruit, peach scented, the mango coconut, and also their kiwi watermelon. Of course, you know me. And then I thought this these would be scented as well, but um, I can't remember if they really are. If this is the Mario Badescu skincare um, facial spray with aloe, cam chamomile, and lavender. And this is the um, with cucumber and green tea. And this one is um, with aloe, herbs, and rose water. So I got all three. Um, if they smell, it's not a huge scent or like, it's not like strong. Um, this one I don't think smells. This is the Bloom Effects Tulip Dew Mist Fragrance. It says Fragrance Free Hydrating Mist. And then I have the OC um, Sea Minerals Mist. I've used this once on a try-on video and that's about it. Um, then I have the Urban Decay All Nighter. This is a lot of people's favorites and it does um, smell good so I use that for Sun Saturday as well I have um, I just got this complex culture filter out daily blue light defense mist and it doesn't smell I just got that um, I've had this um, so I gotta shake it up it's a mat from the magic collection glowy hydrating mist base body and hair Ultra lightweight glitter pigment creates a naturally radiant glow, long lasting wear, fine mist, and hydrating prep, set, and grow. So I don't know why. I, I've never put it on my body or my hair, but I don't, I don't get that. Then from Flower Beauty, I got the Seal the Deal long lasting setting spray. I love Flower Beauty. I just have a hard time finding their products because even though they say it's at CVS or Walgreens or some of these other stores i can never find it the only the only thing i've been able to find their line is on amazon and i don't i don't like buying stuff online from the site because i don't want to pay shipping and i have amazon prime and they sell it on amazon so i get it there um fenty beauty setting spray and this is the what it do um i got that in a boxy charm and then i have this Anastasia Beverly Hills Dewy Set. I have the Pacifica Cherry Matte Setting Spray because I had to get, you know, the whole line that smells. You know me. Oh, I do have more Makeup Revolution. I have the Elf um, Collection that they made, um, Long Lasting Setting Spray. This did not smell though that I noticed, but I got this around, I think, Christmas time. So when I got that, I lost my smell. Um, 
And then I have from Morphe, the Sour Patch um, Watermelon Slice um, setting spray. That smells good. And then from Went Wild, I have the Cucumber and two of the Coconut Scented Setting Sprays. And then I have the Went Wild Matte Finish one, which um, this one's not scented though. Uh, I got that in, I think, the Went Wild Evan box that I bought for Christmas. And then I have the Pharmacy Makeup Setting Spray. This doesn't smell either. This came in with my kit when I decided to start selling it. And then this is the Dewy Coconut Setting Mist from e.l.f. And I believe that is it for that. And the riddle of the day is, the more you take, the more you leave behind. What is it? You guys have a great day. See you next time.